Okay, so my name's Eric Lambert. Uh, I was trying to make this video yesterday, but uh, unfortunately I had an incident, so I'm kind of reviewing and giving a detail for a person that might want to buy my DR Pro Series 30 inch uh, brush mower. And this is what happened. I was trying to show them that uh, it could cut through anything over three inches, but unfortunately my pulley sheared off so now I know why they gave an extra pulley and actually I'm kind of amazed that the pulley lasts as long as it did because I really ran, run this thing hard I don't use it to cut grass I use it to cut down trees scrub brush heavy stuff so it kind of shows you it sheared straight off so I replaced that that came with the machine so this is kind of a demonstration so I'm going to cut this tree down and then I'm going to do a few passes just to show the quality of the cut of the actual uh, mower so I've got my caliper here so that I can show you and it's not zero but that's good because we don't need to know what five tenths of an inch so we're gonna I can't really get around this uh, let's see no, approximately that so right now we're looking at uh, 3.38 inches or 3.33 inches which I think is actually over I think it's only rated at three inches so I, I've done I think I've done bigger stuff than this and of course that's determined by the species of your tree and uh, a few other things so we're just gonna make a few passes here I'm gonna kind of scroll over the mower real quick before I do that and then I'll set up and uh, hopefully I won't break anything this time So this is uh, the DR Pro Series, this thing's heavy duty. I've gotten a lot of use out of this. As a matter of fact, it's too good. Uh, I really don't have a use for it, I'm actually moving, but I've already cleared off everything that I needed to clear off. So we're gonna set up and we'll just, uh, we'll just film this. Hopefully I can get uh, my camera to stay up. I don't know if I got the tree in there. Bear with me and apologize. Okay, that'll work.
So as you can see, I got hung up. Uh, that happens. You know, even the big ones that cut six inches that go on the front of skid steers lock up. That's why they have uh, pressure PTOs on them. So let's take a look. Let's measure this. So as you can see, that's approximately part of the wood's missing, but you know, that's four inches. So uh, this thing, this, this piece of equipment passes in my book. You know, even if I go to there, you're still, you know, it, approximately four inches would just cut off. And it didn't really bog down that bad. The, the stuff just got stuck in it and it couldn't eject it. So that's uh, kind of my review. The stuff actually, I think it cuts great. Once again, it's gonna leave a little bit of material that's really tall, but for scrub brush and briars and stuff like that, we'll just tear through it. I've actually cleared this entire pasture with like uh, 10 and 12 foot scrub brush and I ate it all with this. I did it all. So that kind of concludes my video. Thank you.